Hi folks, my hair is as always brilliantly standing up everywhere it shouldn't be. Um, my name's Andrew. Um, for those of you new to the channel, I'm part-time eBay reseller and uh, a mental health advocate. Today is a listing live where we will be listing some blazers. Um, using my wonderful ladies mannequin to put men male blazers on. Um, I hope to be in the cow shed doing this by now, but um, it's not happened yet. So I'm doing it from home. So uh, yeah, without further ado, we'll get started. I'll say hello to anyone who joins us. Hi, Martina. Hi, Brandon. How are you? Um, I'm at the photography stage first off. I'm going to get my photographs taken. Um, and then I'm going to get into uh, actually listing the items. So first item we have is a Marks and Spencers, a vintage Marks and Spencers. Hi, Paula Ann. Hi, Rebecca. Hi, VV. Uh, first item we have is a vintage Marks and Spencers um, blazer, uh, lamb's wool thing. I think that cost me about three or four, three pound. Um, fine Italian fabric yeah I'm gonna take some pictures of that list it for $24.99 so uh yeah bear with me while I just get the shots I'll try and get this in the shot as well there we go so you can see what's going on right here we go shoot that's done actually I might Pull the buttons out in front of it first. Shoot. There we go. Turn the mannequin slightly. Get a side angle shoot shot. Shoot. Shoot. Done. Turn the angle again. Do. Shoot. Uh, let's get this. Uh, Turn those back. Just like to take a rear view shot as well. Wow. Really need to start putting this stuff on men's mannequin, but that's in the cow shed. Shoot. Shoot. There we go. Get a little puckle of pictures of the composition. I'll just say a couple of lows first. Uh yeah, I've got a male mannequin. It's just in the cow shed, and I'm not in the cow shed. Um, let's get some pictures of the composition and the care label so that people know what it is. Uh, shoot. Hundred percent pure new wool, apparently. Oh, better than second-hand wool, I guess. Sh uh. Shoot. Do one sale today? I've had none, which is why I am listing stuff um, now rather than sorting out stock, which is what I wanted to do. Um, say, lovey. C'est la vie, c'est la vie. Um, just got to change a couple of settings on this as well. Try and access myself on the um, uh, on the uh, YouTube. Hi DFD, how are you? Double karma, and you? Hello. Mill sales. Yeah, this is normally my best day of the week for sales. Um, so uh, it is disappointing to have not had any sales yet today really um first i've just spent about 40 quid in the range so you really need to um to replace with some actual sales from ebay uh to do just change that save there we go right i'm just going to access the actual chat on youtube because um when this thing catches up because uh, this can take a while. I see. How are you? If anyone wants to join in for the um, on the streamyard for this, more than welcome to. I'll be live until about half six before I go, when I go for my Sunday dinner. 
there's a link there in the chat anyway um right so get back to taking the pictures do uh shoot all right i just need to get some scissors hi rob how are you um i should get some scissors to cut the labels off i will be back momentarily <sighs> Do, 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 do. and i'm back can i get this label off without killing myself i've done it i am the greatest clothing reseller ever uh john's there hey john how are you uh to do See if I can get the uh, chat up on YouTube because it's usually a bit. No, I'll just stick to streaming. I can't be bothered. Um, you'll have to forgive me. I'll have about a 20, 30 second delay on the on the um, on the chat. So looks like we've got a loose thread there as well. Get my little safety scissors out. Hi Richard, how are you? Uh, hope you're well. Do, do do there we go i might just take a little photo of uh hmm. some little marks on the line but nothing there uh, nothing major shoot there we go that is one photographed the light is on martina the lights are on um right next we've got a top shop velvet blazer cost three pound it should go for about 15 so it's not massive profit but i bought it because i used to have the very same blazer um so it was nostalgic purchase for me to sell on hey for a beast yeah i'm okay managed to smash a window in my land rover today so that's annoying well I say smash crack a window in my land rover hitting it with a tv so uh i'm listing stuff on ebay as a result right let's get this top man blazer photographed uh, shooting anyone i'm taking pictures um right shoot So he's just backs off this bloody velvet thing. Should do well. Party season coming up. Shoot. Do. Okay. Yeah. Shoot. Actually, I might just angle that that way slightly. Shoot. So we don't see the boobies. You don't want to see the boobies on the lady mannequin on the men's blazer. All right, turn that round. Uh, there we go. Go. Oh, slightly creased. Oh well. Shoot. Go. Let's get some pictures of the labels. Shoot. Branding. Where's your care label? Well, apparently, you should keep this away from fire. shoot oh drop the phone awesome I'm not a, I'm not, no this won't fit me boob cell go and listen to facebook puck a couple of 14 decent games i don't manage to crack the window i hit it with a tv um 
There you go. Got a new 14 P PS3 games for £15. Not bad. Yeah, boobs do so well. Um, right, next blazer. And this is a Marks and Spencer's College Ione or College One um, blazer. Um, yeah, not much more to say about it really. Corduroy style sort of one, some cord. Keyword corduroy. Uh, right. Let's get that listed. When I do the listings, I'll screen share. I'll do measurements and stuff as well. Right. Shoot. There we go. Turn you slightly. Shoot. So you slightly again. Try and get that in shot. Uh, shoot. Let's get around the back. Uh. Do shoot. Right, take a few pictures of the care labels. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Bloody thing, disobey my instructions. Uh. Shoot. Khaki coloured apparently that is. Coins and Mark Suspensers. Fair enough. Um what's going on here? Jason says just had his first as ever sale listed an 80s Burberry sweater for fifty pounds, so in three minutes. Very nice. I've got one of those to list actually. I need to do the same. Uh how much you pay for it, Jason? Right, we're off the blazers. We've got a coat to list now. All these things cost me three quid each from a uh, branch of cancer research in Manchester on my way home from work the other day. Uh, been sourcing on your patch, John. Right, I've got this lovely uh, coat thing. Cost you a pound, nice. Hi Lucy, how are you? If anyone does want to join in the live listing, by the way, there's a link there, feel free to join. Uh, right. This is like a, I'm gonna have to do the buttons up on this. This is like a double breasted, is it? It's called double breasted when it's got like two sets of buttons on it. I think it is. Uh, yeah. Try and get the stuff. It's kind of difficult to do up a coat when um, you're not actually wearing it. What way do I have to do it? I could do it that way. Ah. Come on. Oh, I never thought I would have such difficulty doing up sets of buttons. But there you go. Right. Yeah, it's quite a nice coat actually. If it fits me, I might keep it for myself. Um gotta stop doing that though. I've got to actually sell some stuff. Um Turn this a bit. Yeah, there we go. Shoot. Stop texting. Oh, for God's sake. Shoot. 
shoot 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 all right let's try and turn this around take a picture of the back to confirm that there are no horror stories in it oh, come on come on there we go Shoot. Right. That's that done. Just take some pictures of the labels. And they will be sorted. Just see what's going on in the chat. Not going to, uh, terrible Joe Clone Wolf. To do. What will I need to put to I'm moving stock. And yeah, moving stock. Um, uh, do. Right, let's take some pictures of the labels. Focus, shoot. Uh, let's see if I can find the uh, care label. Around here somewhere down here. Do yeah, try clean only eighty percent wool. Shoot. There we go. Nice John Russia coat. That's photographed. One more coat to photograph, and then uh, we can uh, actually get these listed. This I picked up with Richard Payne. It is Arcturix. You know, I think there's something to do with um, Stone Island or whatever it is that popular brand that costs a fortune coat. So this hopefully should be about a sixty pound coat that cost me eight pounds. So uh, yeah, let's get that on. Do zip it up to show the zip actually works. Uh. All right. Oh, I've got it the wrong way round. We've got a boot. We've got. A We've got the boobies there. Turn around. No boobies on display today. Zip up to the top. on the mannequin yes my phone's voice activated so the John Ross your coat for £35 fair enough probably list that for 35 then it cost me £3 no shoot it's not going to be my catchphrase right here we go pop that back in the corner touch to uh, do Uh, where's the camera app? Can't find the camera app. There we go. Shoot. 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 There we go. 
Shoot. Shoot. Really wish I had a male mannequin, my male mannequin with me for this one, actually, to be honest. It's not looking as brilliant on the female one. Shoot. Picture of it unzipped as well. I'm going to move the hood on so people can see the hood. Shoot, shoot. There we go. Right, turn it round. Bit of a mark there. I'm just going to go and grab a sponge. Be back in a second, folks. Hey, tea cakes. Military style and wool then. Excellent, okay. I don't know if that's military style or not. Uh, right. Oh! This doesn't come off now. I will have to clean it properly. How not to clean clothes, folks. Right, that looks like it's clean now. Excellent. And I have successfully just fell over a cable as well, but fortunately, none of you saw it. Um, right, you get on, get on the, oh God, get on the mannequin properly, God's sake. Always oh, the last item you photograph that's got to be a pain in the backside. Right. Shoot. There we go. Right, let's take these all into the lounge now, get them measured. And uh, get them listed. And knock the cable in the process as well. All right. Oh, don't fall over that. Whoa, 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 whoa. 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 Just pop you on there for a second. I clear some space. There's, I've got my latest charity shop hole down there. Can go on there okay now i've got to um list these items in the order, order i found them hi ali how are you yeah i've seen those uh, inflatable callers in there um in their uh, run i nearly uh i nearly uh pick some up myself but um it's one time of year i'd be sat on them for a while to do I probably should yeah but I'd rather have the mark visible um, Rob because then nobody can complain that it's not as described if it's there in the picture 
1997. When did Rothman's last sponsor F1? Okay. To do. I don't need a TV. The TV is stock double karma. It's for sale. Or it was until I smashed it. I sell TVs. Uh, hi, Ali. How are you? Um, yeah, you can't leave stuff. It's going to make you money. Um, right, okay. So let's fire up the eBay. I do. Might as well put you on the screen share so you can see what I'm doing. Share screen. There we go. The shoot's necessary to voice activate the camera. So, you know. It's very difficult to YouTube and take photos at the same time without. Um, right. Don't even know what I'm doing here. Um, first item I need. What have we got? Oh, yeah, I catch you, Rob. I get you. I thought you meant just, uh, yeah, no, I'm lazy. I'll just leave it there. It's come off now anyway, Rob. It's gone. We're fine. It was just a little um, little mark that uh, just needed a bit of uh, cleaning. Um, right. I'll try and list that coat first. So we'll go for the Arc Arcteryx coat first off. Uh, see if we can find anything in the soles. Uh, Arc next jacket. All right? Why is it not let me type in jacket there? Oh, for God's sake! Ah, so it's jacket in men's clothing. Got a screen share on, haven't I? Right, okay. Um, let's have a look on the soles, see if I can find one the same as mine. Do, I do. It's not new. Let me just put a uh, filter on condition used. Don't know if it is an Atom or a Polo Tech. How do I find out what type of coat it is? Um, oh, it's got a train ticket in it. Better take that out. Somebody has been from Solihull to Birmingham stations in this. Fine. I have no idea unless it says on here. It just says it's a hundred percent polyester. I'll try and take a picture of that care label as well. Uh camera. Shoot. Shoot. Oh, I'm gone. Shoot. Right. Okay. Let's see if I can find the coat the same as this. Don't know what model it is. Uh, I might just filter it down into um, buy it now. Uh, yeah, it's none of those. To do. Just want something similar so I can do a self summer on it because the item specifics are messing about badly at the minute. 
Uh, I'll go highest price and I'll filter down. To do as you can see, these coats go for a fortune. It cost me about eight quid. They all know what bloody brand they've got. They're all Gore-Tex ones. This isn't a Gore-Tex one. Mm -hmm. So let's go on the chat. Hi, Richard. How are you? Returns. Um, I've only ever had one return, and that was because I put the wrong size on an item. Uh, yeah, probably is a windbreaker. Um, but that's not a keyword that people seem to be using for this brand. Uh, to do... We're all putting what type of coat it is in, which is annoying. It's not Gore-Tex. Uh, I did find it before when I bought it, so I know it's here. I didn't buy it long ago. Richard was with me when I bought it. I might even filter by size. Oh, for God's sake. Where's, where'd you put large? There we go. That was that of it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Probably an atom jacket. Oh, there's a windbreaker. We'll probably go with... Oh, no, hang on. I think I just saw it. I think that's the one I've got. Let's just have a look at the pictures. Yeah, I think that's the one I've got. Uh, where's the pictures? Do, do, do. Yeah, that is pretty similar to what I've got. So we'll just go with that one. So somewhere on it. Am I enjoying it? It's, it's, it has its moments. I don't hate it as much as I used to. Um, right. I'm going to take that 10 quill out of it because I'm not 100% certain if that's what it is. Um, and I would say that this is khaki olive and size. Um, large EAN does not apply. She seems to have to type in for some reason now. Um, in good use condition, no rips or tears. Yeah, accept all those. Those are fine. Oh, if I put hooded, yeah, it's hooded. Uh, I'll put windbreaker in as well, like Martina suggested. There we go. Just see how he's described his. Or she has described hers. Um, so it's last in... Khaki slash olive. Did you send you that? The shin is good overall with what the hell is a hem cinch? Does anyone know what a hem cinch is? This bit here. I have literally no idea what that means. 
this is good overall um this is good overall with no rips or tears uh, zip side pockets which is right what's a hem cinch hi laney how are you jd preloved hello jackie hi everyone i'm newbie to this but i uh love all the useful tips and tips for you all i'm just doing clothing at most here i'm learning from the world's greatest ebay clothing reseller you'll learn nothing from me jackie um uh, apart from how not to do things but welcome um right so that's uh i don't know what a hem cinch is what's a hem cinch somebody tell me um i could actually google it can i hem cinch oh it's the cord uh Yes, it has got one of those. I know what that is. Hi, Eminem. How are you? What? Right. We've discussed this. Hi, Rufy. How are you? Yeah. Thank you, Martina. Got it. What's talking about tweenies for? Right, let's go. I need to uh, just measure the pit to pit on this so that I can put it in. And then I can actually list the item. But first, I've just had a low battery warning. So we're going to go get a battery charger, laptop charger. Um, otherwise, I'll lose it. You'll lose you all, you'll get very annoyed. I've got to reach across the um piles of chat. I've actually cleared some stuff out of the kitchen today, Ali. I have broken my Land Rover window in the process, so that's not good. But at least there's some stuff out of the uh, house anyway. Um Right. Tried using my new camera earlier. It's like Jodrell Bank trying to get that thing to work. So I'm going to have to um, read the instructions for it, I think. Can't even get it to take a picture properly. Um, which is not good. It's just saying I'd have pressed the right button or something. So I was getting into an argument with my new camera, which is not a good start to the relationship with my new camera. But I'll figure it out at some point, hopefully, over the course of the week. Hey, Nad, how are you? I can't remember if I replied to your message the other day, Nad, or not, but I, uh, or was it on a YouTube Live? But I very much enjoyed the uh, drinks, they were brilliant. Thank you. And I'm still alive. It's even better. Um, right. Let's try and get this measured. Where have I put the... Uh, where have I put the measuring tape now? Hang on. Uh, dropping stuff. Right, here we go. The measuring tape out. Do pits a pit on this. Is pretty much what I expected for a size large. Whoops, pressed the wrong button, locked the thing then again. 
just process another poetry video okay give give laney a subscribe there then if you like the poetry um right okay let's go on up here right that's fine okay so we'll put a pizza pit pizza pit 23 inches we do save that as a draft when i um Oh, just make sure I've got the right shipping option. Do. Just save that as a draft when I go in and upload some pictures. And we'll have our first item of clothing listed. Um, put the stream yard back on. To do. Um, where am I going? eBay app. eBay app, come to me. Come to me. Right, where's drafts? Selling. Shocking day for sales today. Still not sold anything. By now, I've normally sold about a dozen things at least. So, um, eBay obviously not behaving itself. Let's get these photos uploaded, do a little bit of cropping, and then I can do the listing. Uh, right, here we go. Uh, do. Here we are. Doing a little bit of cropping here, folks. I'll be right with you. Mostly cropping to get the radiator out of the way of the picture. Um, why does the video I made encode and does it have to? Not a clue, Laney. I don't do editing, so I, I'm not the person to ask. Um, unfortunately, I, I wouldn't know what any of that means. Like, literally no clue. Uh, so he might know if he's still watching. Um, but I have no idea. Uh, to do. Let's check this picture's cropped properly. Yep, it has. The next one. That's done. Turn the label over. There we go. Right. For some reason, whenever I crop a picture on um, the eBay app, it um, always puts in a... You turn off Jamie for leave Jamie alone. He's harmless. Um, right. Get back. So listing it then. So I'll go back into my drafts. I'm thinking about listing this one for sixty nine ninety nine and seeing what happens. Um, that last one went for sixty. Um, went for fifty five on an offer and it wasn't as in as good condition. So I think we'll go sixty nine ninety nine on it. I'll just check the pictures have come through. Yeah, they've all come through. Terrible picture quality again, but good enough to do the job. $69.99. Buy it now. Put on a promoted listing. And list. And then watch the circle going around. The most irritating thing ever. Um, I hate watching these circles go around. There we go. We've listed the item of clothing. My brother knows. He's like, yeah, I'll show you. I'm still waiting it weeks later. Sounds that sounds about right. All right. I'm just going to delete these pictures off my app. Um, gallery. 
don't need those anymore. Next item to list is my John Rusher coat. Which is going to be quite interesting because I have no idea at all about styles, styles of coats. John Rusher coat. Um, so I'm going to have to try and find out what it is. Um, now right down to men. Uh, we'll go to sold items. Seven results. Uh, that doesn't quite look like it. I'll take off the solds then, see what's listed. Let's see if we can find something similar. Otherwise, we're going to have to consult with the people of the chat. Pico, that could be it. That says lion coat. Pico could be it. Oh, this says herringbone. This is the sort of this is the same as the coat I've got. What does herringbone mean, folks? I'm gonna have to look up herringbone. Uh, herring bone. What does that mean? Is that just the, the style? Of, oh, it's a pattern. Okay. Do there's self slimmer on that anyway? It's close enough. Yeah, fabric pattern. Uh, black. Um, I'm just gonna see what a pea coat is. See if that looks like it as well. Yeah, that's kind of like it. So I'm going to say it's a pea coat, and I'm going to go thirty four ninety nine. Uh, pea coat size large L. Um, winter. There we go. Yeah, can't have to type in. Does not apply. I got the screen share on. Yeah, I have, yeah, okay. Um, oh, where have I gone now? There's, uh, yeah, I know it's got an invalid value. Does not apply. I hate that they don't just give you the option in the drop down box anymore. Uh, no, everyone's talking about editing. Uh, the do. All right. Yep, that'll do. Uh, what sort of words are you using in your description? Oh, God, they've done proper measurements and everything. Let's just uh, go down here. Right. Now. I reckon I can take the words from there. Paste them in. Oh, all right. Let's just take a few measurements of it. Have to talk amongst yourselves while I'm measuring this. Yeah, it's okay. I'm fine. Um, full screen layout. Sort of layout. All right. There we go. Here's the pile. Um, right, try and find that coat. Oh, well, oh, oh. Here it is. Oh, try and get that. Just 
cover up, sailed up, had it in our own side. Uh, right, get the pizza pit first. Um, here we go. Pizza pit is. 23 inches, which is what I expect for a large, so it's not shrunk, which is good. Oh, so I'll put that in the listing. Uh, armpit to input 23 inches. Sleeve length from armpit to cuff. Let's have a look. From there, that looks to be about 18 inches, but I'll just try and straighten it a little bit. <sighs> Hate doing these measurements, it's the only bit I don't like. Yeah, I'd say that's 18 inches. Uh, Sleeve length from shoulder to cuff. That looks to be about 26 inches. I need to do the length as well. What length are you? So you're 35 inches, so that can't be right. Uh, I'll pop it. Inches. So 1, 2, 5, 2, 5, 34, 35. Looks like it is 37 inches long. Okay. So full length is 37 inches. Uh, I've done that. I just need to do shoulder to shoulder across. Is gonna be a nightmare. Looks like about 19 inches, maybe. Yeah, 19 inches. <sighs> okay. So that's all the measurements taking it in. I'll behave, double karma, for God's sake. Um, right. Got to find my mobile phone now. It's helpful. To do. Yeah, never touch it when it's uploading, Lainey. Uh, where's my phone? There it is. Right. Just save that listing as a draft. Uh, I'm going to list it for 34.99. There's no non sold on buy it now, which doesn't help. But um, chest size L. There we go. Save that as a draft and upload the pictures. I'm going to have to go in a minute, folks, as well. Um, I'm not trying to quite get everything listed um, during this live stream, but if I can get these two items listed, I'm happy. Please provide photos, select from gallery. One, two, three, four, five. 
six upload a little bit of cropping I <laughs> can even see my laptop in this picture definitely need to crop that crop it crop this one again it's a gorgeous coat um, which I am tempted to keep for myself but I need the money to fix the Land Rover uh, after today's shenanigans right there we go photos uploaded just complete the draft to do lesson definitely learned fair enough um so i'll just put the screen share back on so you can see what i've been doing there you go um so yeah I failed to change the size in there. I'll put winter in. Uh, there's my keyword. There's my pictures. Again, not the best, but they'll do the job um, until I can start using my new camera. All measurements in there, as you can see. Just need to change that. Say so size L. Uh, Oh, it doesn't put a. Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, right, thirty-four ninety-nine. Um, change that to small parcel. Um, I might just put. I've taken a picture of the um, what it's composed of. But I might just put a uh, in the description as well. Eighty percent composition outer composition outer yeah outer composition 80 percent wool 20 percent why is that eight why is that look different no i don't know 20 percent uh, nylon Inner composition fifty per cent polyester, fifty per cent viscose, I think it was. Oh, look, yeah, viscose. Now, yeah, fake for ninety-nine small parcel. Promote it. And list it. Go, 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 go. List, 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 list. List. There we go. Hey, Ads, you've joined just as I'm leaving. Um, so excellent timing there, Ads. Right, folks, um, I've got to get off time for me Sunday dinner so I'll see you all soon thank you everyone for watching hope you all have a lovely day and uh, yeah see you on the next live appearance I make wherever I make an appearance bye for now and broadcast